find climate files on the web for use in energy modeling. I'm going to show you two resources, a free one and a paid one. This first one called EPW map is very easy to search. I can go right into the search box and say if I was looking for Coachella, California, and I see there's Coachella and there's a EPW file here in Palm Springs thermal. There's, if I zoom out a little bit, I can also see that there's a few others nearby. There's um, one here in Palm Springs International Airport. There's another one here in 29 Palms. Uh, there's even another one over here in, it's called March Air Force Base. Um, this is also nice that this comes up with a ter Google terrain map. Um, and what this, what, how this is helpful is that it's always good to try to find weather data that is in the same basic geographic area as your building, but also make sure that it's not across any uh, large bodies of water or mountain ranges that would make the data very different. In this case, we've, we lucked out. We've got some very good data uh, very close by, and um, you can see that it gives the latitude and longitude there. I can double click on this, and it will download that EPW file. Now, if you want to take another case, let's look at Astana in Kazakhstan, because this um, map does not have any um, files very close to Astana. In fact, the closest one is Semi, or semi Palatinsk, um, which is about 400 miles away. It's a very long way. And although it's not, uh, doesn't seem to be many geographic fe features like uh, large lakes or mountain ranges that are different, they are uh, distinctly different climate zones. And so you could download Semi and try using that. Um, there's other places to check though if you can't find your data here. There's this weather.whiteboxtechnologies.com. Go to the TMY, I'm going to try IWEC first. This lists a whole bunch of different ones. You can see there are some free ones, which are also listed on the uh, EPW map site. But then these, the IWEC 2 and the CN 2014, are paid. And uh, they're generally about $35 per station. And you can see, especially in Europe, but actually if I zoom out, you can see all around the world, these IWEC files are quite common. Now I've got many worlds here. Let me zoom back into Kazakhstan. The search engine here is not quite as good, but if I zoom in to where Astana is, you can see that there is actually climate data here for Astana. Um, and it's IWEC2. WMO is the, um, the weather data collection site. And I can add this to the cart and check out and pay for it with a credit card and um, and hopefully this gives you a couple different resources for finding data yourselves.